allow corruption to rear its ugly head and permitted it to fester. Want to belittle the discipline, the law, and order we introduced into this country so they can justify their corrupt tendencies. Ladies and gentlemen, the lighting of the perpetual flame and the laying of wreaths is to show reverence to all who sacrificed their lives during that difficult time in our country. Let no one downplay those sacrifices through historical distortions, twists, and utter fabrications. The depth of corruption, of crime today, is so heavy, so deep. But some of us would say, nothing can happen. If things happen like June 4, an explosion, during that period, so many years ago, things are much worse. We're living with it. No, there's, there's been tension. And I suppose it's also because the mass of our people or corruption has eaten so deep into the fabric of the masses of our country that it has taken away that purity, that strength that we used to find at the grassroots. But that should not fool us, anesthetize us into thinking that nothing can happen. And that is why we're supposed to be drawing lessons from that period 